something that I stand by is life is short, make a big impact. Well, you just heard from the first ever Saints fan of the year. This is Stephanie Williams. She is picked not just for presenting and representing the team in the dome and on the road, but also in the community. Yeah, and I had a chance to sit down with Williams about this honor and the story that you'll see only on six. Sunday service for Stephanie Williams always involved the Saints and no, not just the ones in church, the ones on the field. You know, you gather as a family, you watch the games. But she quickly realized that service was truly the foundation behind this New Orleans football team. But it truly, truly is so much more than football. It's it's the philanthropy of the players, the ownership, um, the love thy neighbor mentality that we have as a community. So during the pandemic and seeing the hardships in her community, Williams decided to follow the Saints playbook. There has to be something that I can go do and have a purpose for. Um, and that's where my wheels really started turning. She began giving away masks and food at hospitals and to postal workers and gathering volunteers for Second Harvest Food Bank through her Houdat Nation Facebook fan page. Um, we have been extremely blessed and fortunate to, in recent mem memory, not to just have phenomenal players, but just extremely great men and human beings that want to give back. Her actions brought to the attention of the Saints organization who during the Tampa Bay game surprised Williams with the rare honor of being the first ever Saints fan of the year. And then Tyrone Hughes started to speak and that he was speaking to me and that's when he actually told me that I was a fan of the year. And I just, I really got flooded with emotions. I was in complete shock. Being fan of the year during one of the most trying years is humbling to Williams. And she not only hopes to represent the Houdat Nation, but what the Saints stand for off the field. It comes from the top. It goes from ownership to players. And then they inspire us as fans. And we really work as one to be that that unit and that community that, that helps each other. There is hands down, nobody that does it better than us. And you may see Williams as one of the possible 3,000 during that Saints Kansas City game this following weekend. And uh, hopefully so, because she says the Saints haven't lost a single game that she was at this season so far. So she could be that good luck charm that we need, Quayla. She just